हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल फ्रेंड्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड आवर लेक्चर सीरीज ऑन ऑटोमोबाइल इंजीनियरिंग आई रिक्वेस्ट यू ऑल काइंडली वॉच माय प्रीवियस वीडियो टू बेटर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ टू डेज टॉपिक आई रिक्वेस्ट यू ऑल टू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल फॉर मोटिवेटिंग मी टू ब्रिंग इन मोर वीडियो फॉर द सेम टॉपिक so in today's lecture we will continue with the previous one and starting air suspension system so let's begin air suspension system friends as compared to mechanical type of air suspension air suspension system is very important and gives good effect if you talk about the strength then strength of the air suspension system is very much high here the strength is word is used in terms of the load bearing capacity or shock absorbing capacity then the variable spring rate is high as compared with the mechanical spring because in mechanical spring the material we used cannot be changed once it manufactured but here in air suspension system we can vary the air pressure and by varying air pressure we can get the variable spring rate so that's why we use air suspension system then in practical view the air suspension system is looks like this one this black color is a air suspension unit here you can see three lines are there the first and second line is connected to the control valve and first line is called as a pressure line through which the pressure is coming inside the air suspension unit and second one is a return line if the pressure gets reduced in the system then this pressure going to the control valve with the help of this returning line now the third line is a control line this control line is connected to the leveling valve let's discuss construction and working of air suspension system so here a typical diagram of air suspension system here this side is a front side and this one is a back side so in front side this circular arrangement provided air suspension spring and this is the unit of like this one this black color unit is fitted on the axle of the four wheel here is front wheel now we'll see the construction of this system atmospheric air is coming through the air filter in the compressor the function of compressor to maintain the air pressure in the system and provide the pressurized air as and when required in the system then air accumulator here then air relief valve is there the function of relief valve when the system pressure is increased in the set value then relief valve is open and the air is going to the atmosphere and when the system pressure is released then this valve get closed and the pressure coming inside the system rather to going to the atmosphere now this uh, relief valve is connected one line and then this line is connected to the lift control valve here here one is a lift control valve here is this lift control valve contains two line first one is a supply line one and another is a return line the supply line is used to supply the air to the air spring and return line to collect the returning air this lift control valve also provide one relief mechanism it means when the air pressure goes down then this valve is open and air from this at compressor coming inside and filled with this let's see the function of leveling valve as i said this control line is connected with the leveling valve here two leveling valve the function of leveling valve to maintain the height of the rear and the front wheel it means the four leveling valve is connected the function of leveling valve to maintain the level of front and rear wheel with the fixed level friends with the help of this air suspension system 
वन कैन इंक्रीज और डिक्रीज द हाइट ऑफ द व्हीकल और द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द रोड एंड द चेसेस कैन बी इंक्रीज और डिक्रीज लाइक दिस So let's see the function when the uneven surface is coming on the road then the tires moving upside tire moving upside and with this all the shocks is coming from the tire to this air suspension here and as the air is present inside then it compresses and expand this unit and because of this the pressure line is increase or decrease the prayer air pressure and in this way we will get very minimum shock to be transferred to the frame as much amount of shocks can be absorbed by this air suspension unit so in this way the function of air suspension system this air suspension system is generally used in luxurious car and you can say that high class vehicle like mercedes audi etc also it is used in a, some trucks and some passengers car semi luxurious i hope you understand the working of air suspension system